starting with the home side, Greenville Triumph. Yeah, four changes for Rick Wright from the Midweek Cup victory over Knoxville. Hey, Nansen, the big one. Jake back in Greenville. Four changes from their extra time win in midweek. First start, first pro start for Ethan Hall. He scored a goal. This is where the fun begins. It's the Greenville Triumph and Northern Colorado Hailstorm for 90 minutes right here on ESPN+. Plus. Danny Robles got away with a bit of a handball there on the ground. Ref letting them play. A lot. Sniffing out that pass and then a good touch to distribute, but now the Hailstorm have the ball once again. Here they come. Service comes inside and bounces away. Not close enough to the target at the end of it. As well as Chapa Herrera. Adam Smith, we've seen him play true center back this season, but now he's playing right center back in a back three. We've seen him play wing back. Here's an opportunity here. Powder cuts inside, takes a shot, and it's straight into the hands of Christian Garner. And this is having to move him out of the way every time. Lofted skyward, headed away. A second notch for good measure, then Herrera off the crossbar. I think you'd see it a little more because it, it's almost like having a free kick every time you have a throw in down in the final third. Scarlet winding around, Zion Scarlet plays a shot, parried away. Lalo Delgado denies entry. I think Garcia was looking for the offside flag. Good effort to keep that ball in. Smith rockets it into center. Sikowski with a chesting effort. Martinez gets away and then a body's tripped. And is it a point to the spot? Yes, it is. Right at the perimeter. It, you talk yes. about Bert Shipman making the save <laughs> a couple weeks ago. Lalo Delgado, another guy who is more than capable of stopping it from the spot. Can Greenville get this monkey off their back? With a puff. And a score! Lyon McKinnon puts the triumph up top. He's composed. And he's put this one away. You know, Delgado saved a couple of penalties last season, but no chance on that one. A well-struck penalty by McKinnon. He's racking up the goals now. Got it went the right way, but no chance on that one. Into the roof of the net, right where you want it. 1-0 triumph. Last year played with Knoxville. As we get that whistle for halftime. A penalty kick is the difference in this one. Lyon McKinnon putting it away with authority. Makes it 1-0 in favor of the home side. Both teams will go to the dressing rooms to toss it in. Here's that one pretty far. Ball's right back to him. Oprah with some good service. Now Powder slicing into that ball. He made good contact. It was a difficult technical shot. Could have gone anywhere. Now Castro pushing forward. Sends Scarlett running. Zion Scarlett across the goal. Herrera now has players. Castro beats the keeper. And Greenville double the advantage. Thought Zion Scarlett had made the wrong decision. He perhaps should have taken it himself. Tried to be unselfish. Didn't cost him in the end as Greenville doubled their lead. Lovely ball from Castro. It's a great idea from Scarlett. Yeah, perhaps he didn't see Chela Martinez checking back. There's Castro with another professional finish. And also a professional aftermath checking on Lala. It's a horde. Taps it to Robles. It's just behind him and in the air. And Greenville will push forward once again. Zion Scarlett turning on the burners. Scarlett plays it across to McKinnon. Lyon McKinnon splits the wickets and scores. Three for Greenville and a brace for Lyon McKinnon. Back to back brace performances for the youngster. Work again, done by Scarlett. Looked like that ball might fall a little short for McKinnon, but Chela Martinez made a bit of a mess of it. He had to do what he had to do there, but perhaps should have tried and cleared it the other way with his left foot, and in the end, 
Just laid it into the path of McKinnon, who still had work. Increased level of caution in that regard. Yeah, I expect, you see, talking to the bench now, expect some changes here in the next five minutes for the hailstorm. Get those tired legs off, there's a chance now. Oprah slips it by the keeper. And the hailstorm have one back. It's a steep hill, but it starts with one step if you're Northern Colorado. And just let up get around him. Garner came out well to try and make himself big, but a composed finish. Nice overlapping run by Oprah. Lucky Oprah with his first goal of the season. Had three goals. Horde is running, and he'll now track this ball down. One on one with Fricky. Ethan Horde gets his man to slide. He shoots, and it rockets over top. Now Corvino. The man tracking behind him. Lucky Oprah doing well to hustle there. Para sends it to the left. Hernandez. Now Powder with a sifting ball inside. Para heads it down. We'll see where Gabo slots in. Header floating over top the crossbar. Aiden Manderson looking to play. The full 90 after playing so much of that game. Gabo takes a strike. And Delgado couldn't keep it in his arms, but gets the job done. Thought better of lashing out there. And there's your final whistle. Now this is Greenville Soccer. 3-1 your final result. The Triumph taking down Northern Colorado Hailstorm.